What's up? It's Marcus. I've been making a living online for the last 19 years from the comfort of my backyard office. And in this video, I'm going to show you 10 completely legit ways to start making money on the internet fast. All right, so let's dive right in and talk about these 10 totally legit ways to start making a living online fast. Now, I've listed the top ones in black, the next three in red, and the bottom ones in green. The reason I did that is because the top five are going to be pertaining to things that you have to do every day, right? I have to do something every day in order to get a check. The next three are things that will build you an income over time or create passive income. And the last ones are the hit the ball out of the park ways to make a full-time living and sustain it for a long time, just like I have over the last 19 years. So let's go ahead and start with number one. Number one is probably one of the most obvious ones. This is the grunt work. This is where you go out there and you get paid to view ads. You can go to sites, you can get paid to view ads on a per ad basis. You can go to reward sites, you can go to different giveaway sites and things like that and you could look at ads check out the ads view them and you get paid now the downside is is you're only going to make like a penny or two pennies per view which means you would have to work like 8,000 hours a day in order to make anything worth writing home about that in my opinion is not a good way to make money online number two is to buy and sell things on ebay or amazon we see this happening all the time where people buy different products at garage sales or on craigslist and they sell it on ebay or amazon for a profit they even go and buy what's known as a haul that's where you buy a bulk of returns from amazon or something like that and you part it out and sell each individual item at a profit now sometimes you can buy an entire haul for for a couple hundred bucks and sell it for a couple thousand. But that's kind of rare. And of course, you gotta have the money to buy the stuff in the first place. And in my opinion, it's a lot of work for a little bit of money. Let's go on to number three. Number three is to write content for other people. Now you can actually go on sites like Hire Writers, Fiverr, and various other content sites, and you can actually write reports, write content for other people's websites. Now I buy content for my websites all the time, and I usually pay somewhere between five to thirty dollars for an article obviously the five dollar article is gonna be like 500 words and the thirty dollar article is gonna be like a couple thousand words so as you can see it's going to take time to do that but that's a great way to get started if you want to make like three to ten dollars an hour depending on which site you're using now on number four we're actually diving into some of the leverage stuff this is where you start to leverage other people's audiences and other people's advertisements to make money this is where you can actually be a middleman between a website owner or an influencer and an advertiser that's right you can actually go find influencers who don't know how to make money you can contact them and then have a database of advertisers to go to and sell ads at a profit. This is a very easy thing to do because a lot of influencers and a lot of site owners don't know the value of their traffic. So oftentimes you can broker a deal, they think they're getting paid a ton and you shave off a little bit for yourself, obviously disclosing that in the agreement as the middleman. Very great way to make income and it's something you can do on a long term because these influencers and advertisers are always going to be there. So you can always make a profit. You've seen big companies do this like Google AdSense, Taboola, and various other places where you can actually bid on advertisements from different places and place advertisements on different websites and to different influencers and everything like that. Let's go to number five. Number five is to sell your skills as Fiverr gigs. That's right, there are people right now selling gigs on Fiverr. What's Fiverr? Well, Fiverr is a site where you go and you pay five bucks, hence the name Fiverr, and you pay five bucks for a skill. Now, don't be discouraged. All the gigs are not five dollars. Some of them are 60. I've paid as much as $500 for a gig. Now, what happens is you go on Fiverr and you put a skill. Let's say you design a logo, which Let's be realistic, a logo takes about five seconds to make. You can go up there and sell logos for $5, $10, $20, and you can rake in a profit all day long. Just imagine if you're able to sell 10, 15, 20 logos a day, you'd be raking it in. And the list goes on and on from people making little videos to taking pictures to doing various website work. All kinds of things are listed on Fiverr. You could even do voice recordings. I got a voice recording a couple weeks ago for 300 bucks 
and it only took the lady a couple hours to set up. So imagine how much she can make selling these gigs every single day. Fiverr is a great way to make money and build a database of customers who are interested in a certain thing. You can sell them other gigs, sell them the same gig for different things, and build a great income that way. Plus, it's a great way if you are in a jam and you need to make money right now, learn a few skills from building a WordPress theme to creating a logo to making an audio recording or building a website or even creating a video. You can do these extremely fast with no upfront money and start pocketing cash fast. Now the cool thing is is that you get paid instantly to your PayPal account. So this is money you can start using right away. Now number six, we're getting into some of the more specific stuff that's going to make you an income for a long time. This is the kind of thing where you build an asset once and you leverage it over and over to make money. Now I have a Facebook group of my own, but I haven't used it as much as I should. I've made some money on it, but not as much as some friends of mine who actually have Facebook groups and they make thousands and thousands of dollars each and every week just sending different offers to their Facebook group, listening to the questions they have, commenting, providing answers, and providing help. Help, and it's extremely easy to do. You could build these groups by answering things in other groups, advertising your group, or even putting it on the search engines or writing a press release or something like that for your group, get it out there, and start providing value by answering people's questions. Just imagine, you can have a group from anything, from video cameras, to how to build websites, to how to put ads on the internet, to ways to make money on the internet. The sky is literally the limit here, and you can make a group about anything you want and send them to things things that make you money. Number seven is quite an obvious one, yet very few people do this the right way. You might have noticed here on my YouTube channel, which if you haven't, you might want to subscribe because we go through all this stuff in detail. But on my YouTube channel, I got lots of videos here. Now, not a giant YouTube channel. We got decent amount of subscribers, some good views, but we're not as big as some of the others. But we are able to leverage and make a lot of money because of the focused nature of our videos. And it's very easy to do. You just pick a topic and you stick with it. Far too many people make YouTube channels about everything or YouTube channels about jokes or gags. And that's all fine and good, but you need to keep it closely knit because the closer knit your audience is, the more specific the more you're gonna make on the ads. If you have a general audience that's just coming to you to watch everything and be entertained, it's gonna be a lot smaller of an income you make. If you have something focused, say, marketing tips for doctors, then hey, that's gonna make a lot more per view and not to mention, it's a lot easier to get involved in that market. So you could do anything you want from a YouTube channel about how to deal with gardening, to how to build sheds, to how to film videos, how to do magic tricks, or literally anything you can think of, you can make a channel about it, and there's advertisers ready to pay you big for ads on your site. For example, if you were to take the gardening one, you could go to Terminex and generate leads. If you were to take the shed one, there's guys providing shed plans, or Home Depot affiliate links, Amazon affiliate links, and more. So, creating a focused YouTube channel is a great way to go, but you need to learn how to do it right. And again, if you subscribe, we got some great videos showing you how to do just that. Let's go into number eight. Number eight is kind of a diabolical, cool thing that you can do. There are tons of people out there that do not have websites. Yes, you heard that right. It's almost 2019 and there are still people that do not have websites. You can learn how to set up a website in as little as 15 minutes, a custom website using WordPress. You can actually go and give these websites away. But Marcus, if I give these sites away, how the heck am I gonna make money? Well, I'm glad you asked, because in order to have a website on the internet, you need something called web hosting. And the web hosting affiliate companies pay anywhere from 65 to $300 when someone signs up for hosting. Now, here's the cool thing. You get paid 60 to $300, but the customer is only charged somewhere between two and 50 bucks a month. Very, very inexpensive for them, so they're getting a great deal, they're getting a free website, and you get a check from 60 to $300, depending on which hosting company you recommend. This is a great way to make money when you're first starting out. Just imagine if you can give away two sites a day, spend maybe an hour on each of them, you're gonna be making yourself around $50,000 a year with very little work. Now again, the results are not typical, implied, or guaranteed. I don't know what you'll make. The average person who watches videos like this never does anything, therefore, 
they never make anything. Now on number nine, we're starting to get into the things that are the big dollar stuff, the hit the ball out of the park kind of things that put money in your pocket for years to come. And number nine is to host a specific review show. That's right. You make a little review show, whether it's video based or audio based. You post that show on either YouTube or Facebook. Either one is really easy for getting traffic. You make that show about certain things in your market. Well, let's say I have a show, which actually I do, about addiction and recovery. It's kind of a personal show that I do based on my personal experience. I'm four and a half years sober today. And in that show, we have people who come on every single week and watch the show and listen to things that we have to say. Sometimes we have guests. The cost to produce it is simply my internet connection and a video camera or web camera. So anyone can do this. You go into your niche, you talk about the topic, and you drive people to things that pay you money. For example, if you're talking about various different website tasks, you could lead them all to web hosting. If you're talking about how to build logos for your business, you could lead them to Fiverr gigs. Psst, by the way, as of the time I'm shooting this video, Fiverr actually pays $100 for a new customer to sign up and buy a gig for just five bucks and you get a hundred. Crazy, isn't it? So you could literally host a weekly show about different things that people can buy on Fiverr to help their business grow or whatever they need on the internet, and boom, you can get paid every time they sign up. Now let's get into number 10, which is my favorite, obviously, because I'm Marcus, AKA the affiliate marketing dude. My favorite way to make money online for the last 19 years after trying many of these different things has always and will always be affiliate marketing. Affiliate marketing is where I set up a website or an ad or go on forums and help people and drive people to an affiliate link. That's right, all I have to do is drive people to a custom affiliate affiliate link, whether it's Amazon, Best Buy, CPA affiliate marketing, or whatever it is, I can drive people to that affiliate link and get paid every time they buy something, fill out a form, download something, click on an ad, call a phone number, and more. There's lots of ways that I can get paid as an affiliate marketer, and it really is as simple as getting people to click on a link. Now, if you'd like to learn more about any of these 10 legit ways to make money online, subscribe to my channel right now and go check out affiliatedude.com slash legit. That's affiliatedude.com slash legit. I actually have a custom report written for you about how to do each of these things. So if you say, Marcus, I wanna do that one you talked about with Craig or I want to do that one you talked about with free WordPress sites. We got the guide there. You just go to the page, you follow the instructions, and hopefully you'll make a little money. Just like our friend did a couple weeks ago when she watched a video about how to set up a site for Black Friday. She set up a site in about 45 minutes, and by the time she woke up in the morning, she had made money. That's right, in less than 10 hours. So you can see that this stuff works like a charm. And if you wanna learn more about that, make sure you subscribe, click the bell notification so that you get our live trainings and our new videos when we come out with them. And then make sure you go to affiliatedude.com slash legit. Thanks again for watching the 10 legit ways to make money on the internet. I'm Marcus and I'll see you in the next video. It's gonna pop up around here somewhere. And make sure you subscribe there. Right there.